Hi everyone! So I've just been to Aldi and I've just picked up another bargain this time and actually there's got quite a few here. Um, the first one being quite exciting, we finally managed to get ourselves a TV. So I'll be unboxing that later. Um, Sean's been on a night shift last night so he's asleep still so I'm going to walk the dog first because I can hear him barking inside the house and then I'm going to come back and unbox that. Another thing that I bought for a fiver each, bowl cleaner and toilet fluid. Ooh, the little munchkin. I managed to wake Sean up so we're going to do the review on the road! <laughs> Right, it's time to review the bowl, <laughs> which I think is supposed to look like brawn. Uh, 25 point, 21, sorry, 0.5 inch full HD TV DVD combi. And it's 1080p as I understand it. I picked this up from Aldi this morning. On a, if anyone has ever been to Aldi on a Sunday morning, as soon as it opens as well, you'll know how chaotic it ends up being. I was there, uh, picked it up. There's quite a lot of people getting these as well. But I think they're a bit of a bargain. 124.99 this was. Right. So I guess that's all the cables, all the extra little bits in there, and the remote. in it too. I don't know if you can see. Yeah, there you go. So you can actually watch DVDs on it as well. And am I right in saying, Sean, that it's, um, well, it's HD ready. HD ready. Yeah, it's 1080p. 1080p, but it's also free view, isn't it? Uh, yeah, it's got free HD free view uh, tuner in it as well. Yeah. Have a look at what's in here. So we've got the normal cable. Like there. Yeah, so that normal, can, it can just be plugged in. Normal 230 volt yeah. cable. But the most important bit is that bit. The fact that you actually get a 12 volt socket with it. So that means we can use it uh, when we're not plugged into an electrical hookup. So it comes What's with that? a nice remote as well. Good. There you go. Superb. And batteries for that as well. A couple of little batteries for that. So, and then all the little scart sockets and all sorts of bits that you need for it. Are they called still called scart sockets? No, they're they? not, but we'll. Oh, they're we'll the bolts. Out. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you won't. <laughs> yeah, they're the screws, aren't they? Yeah, oh, that's pretty good. Yeah. 36 month warranty on this, which is quite exciting. Yeah, so keep the receipts if you do get one. So what are you up to? Setting up the TV. Sean has got a digital TV aerial, a little one. I shall show you that. The, uh... It's just a um, travel aerial. Um, and it is actually finding channels. Yeah, it's found 90 digital ones already which is quite amazing yeah the tv's a bit wobbly at the moment as well because we didn't have a screwdriver so it's very precariously put on its stand at the moment once we get a screwdriver it'll be fine but we had to use a pair of first aid scissors 
<laughs> so what are your thoughts? I think it's brilliant. And when I initially thought that it would be too big, I don't think it is now. I think it's quite a good size. Yeah, Especially right, that you're going to be sat back. I mean, like I say, we're going to put it on the headrest eventually because we can get a, um, a mount for the headrest. So it'll be sat over there and we'll be sat over here watching. So it seems a really good size. The sound's not amazing, but um, certainly picked up a lot of TV channels. Ruth and Steph's son. Okay, good to see you. Okay. Yeah, uh, right. Let's go. yeah, it looks really good. Seems alright, doesn't it? Yeah, seems fine. So, how long have you had this debilitating crush on the uh, travel editor? Crush on Darcy? Yeah. No way, dude. No, I like First it. Of all, you're I really like home. it. Why don't you just the remote's easy to use. Oh, you don't think I could ask her out? No. Yeah, I could ask her out. Oh, it's called the Strawberry Watch. No problem. It'd take me five seconds. Will you go out with me? But if you've been framed. Hard to believe I know. But that's Sid Little in that costume. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, do the job. That does the job. 124 quid. We were just saying that um, we were looking at Tesco's. There were ones on there for about 100 pounds, um, but they were 19 inch, and we wouldn't have been able to use them now because they weren't on a 12 volt. They were just on a normal plug. So yeah, our 230 volt socket down there only works when we're plugged into the uh, mains hookup. So where so we this are is now? great. So Back we can actually do wild camping and have the TV if we want to. Apart from that subject, I'll just show you where we are. We did have all this to ourselves at first. A few more cars have turned up now. But, um, yeah, quite good. Seems to be doing the trick. But the fact that we can watch TV, not that we will be doing a lot of watching TV. The whole point is to get out and about, but it's just handy on we we use this um, all year round, don't we? Yeah. So it'd be just nice in the uh, in the winter. It's got, I like the fact it's got a DVD player as well. That's quite nice. So we can actually take DVDs away and watch some films. And as far as the aerial goes, it's this August DTA two forty. So it's a um, yeah, it's a digital TV aerial. It receives Freeview, DAB ra radio, and analog TV. Um, and it comes with a 1.5 meter cable as well. So this is the actual aerial itself. And like I say, it's um, it's non-directional, so you can put it anywhere. Now, I, we've only just tried it for the first time here in the New Forest, and we did pick up plenty of channels. Um, it's just gonna be a case of seeing how we get on. So we'll, we'll revisit this once we've used it in various locations, because it was it was cheap. I'll put a link in the description below to uh, show you which one it was. We are surrounded by trees though and it did work well. Yeah. It's pretty good. Yeah. It's magnetic, you can stick it anywhere on the van. Um, and yeah, it seems to be so far so good, but very small test so far. We shall let you know. So yeah, it seems really good. So Saudi at the moment, 124.99. You can get loads of fluids as well, which I pointed out earlier, the toilet fluids for about £5 for a two litre bottle. Again, it's really good bargains. There's also windbreakers for £25. They're huge windbreakers. They're not really appropriate for us because we've got such a small van and we don't really need them, but they've got tons of stuff at the moment. So um, go down to your local Audi and find out. And again, we're not sponsored by Audi. It's just we found a really good deal. So I wanted to share it with you guys. So don't forget to uh, subscribe and uh, keep watching for more videos in the future. See you soon. Thank you.